Danielle. Yeah, I know. I'm real sorry. Here's your bag for the night. Count it and get busy. Yes, sir. Thanks for coming. I'm sorry. I'll forgive you for giving me all your tips. Just kidding. <laughs> Help me catch up, okay? Okay, we need uh, one Irish whiskey, bourbon rocks, and two premiums for them over there. And two house dress for those guys. Who did you pick her up? <sighs> she comes in with him sometimes. He's married? No, I just thought. Uh, who knows? Hard to figure out. I mean, a good-looking man with somebody like that. You know, I know nothing. There, Rebecca. There. Yeah, I don't know what his trip is. It's always been good to me, though. You ever hit on you? Hmm, jealous? <laughs> what do you think? How could he help himself? <laughs> oh, my advice is forget it, girl. If I thought of every weirdo that comes in and out of this place, I'd go insane. And you've worked bars before. Worst place in the world to hook up. Hey, where have you been? Could you break this for me? A couple of fives, a ten. That was four fives. Okay, that's good. Thank you, Diane. I'm okay. I'm fine. I um, I just sort of tripped a little. That's all. Yeah. Nothing. I'm fine. That's all. Yeah, everything's Nothing. cool. Everything's. Okay. Can we just mix some drinks? Just... What happened? Did you see something? The same girls. I think one of them was over. God, Daniel, you gotta call the cops. I mean, you're just gonna laugh at my face. Well, you gotta do something. I mean, you just can't. Unless maybe this isn't real. Could it be something else? Oh, my brain too. No. No, I've been through this before. And you know what? If I don't serve some drinks, I'm gonna have visions of myself standing in the unemployment line. Looks like you're having a hard night. You scared me. I didn't realize it was you. Oh, sorry, sir. Can I help? Uh, no. I'm just gonna go in and call a cab. Why? I'm a pretty good mechanic. Pop her open. Let me take a look. Maybe I'll get you going. You're gonna get filthy. If it's a complete engine rebuild, I'll pass. But you never know. T take a look. What happened in there tonight? Nothing, I'm just on overload, I guess. That was a whole lot of nothing. And you know, sometimes it helps if you talk about it. I don't even know you. Here's your chance to get to know me. 
I know it sounds like a line, but I care about you. I like you. So where's your girlfriend? <laughs> she's not my girlfriend. She's my roommate. Anyways, uh, she was a little drunk tonight, so I took her home. Can you tell what's wrong? You said you tripped in there. That's not what happened. I was watching you. What? Are you sick or something? No, it's not like that. But it was like something just suddenly took a hold of you. What is it? It's all right. I don't want to upset you. Hey, look at this. Distributed cap is loose. Twice now. First time I was handing you a glass, remember? Then tonight I gave you money for change and it happened again. If I didn't know any better, I would think it had something to do with me. I don't want to talk about this. It scares me. If you're afraid that I'm going to think you're, you're some weirdo or something, I'm not. I just want to know what it is. Where do you go? What do you see? See, awful places, dark, it terrifies me. Visions. I really got to get going. Well, look, you should be all set here. Tell you what, look for me in those visions that you have. You might learn something interesting about both of us. Go ahead, give her a try. Thanks. All right. Let me see something. Hold out your arm. What are you doing? The waitress. The girl at the bar. I want her to have this. It's mine. <laughs> what makes it yours? You, you know what makes it mine. I want to thank you again for the other night. I told you, it's no big deal. I like you. I wish you could sit down and talk for a while. It's pretty busy. Maybe later. Uh, do you want me to keep your tab open? Uh, nah, you know, I better not. Moderation, right? Yeah, I guess. No, no, no. That's for you. In fact, I have something else for you. I don't understand. That's for you. I want you to have it. Why? Because I, I want you to have it. <laughs> I look pretty on you. So take it. Wow. <laughs> you can't 
you. This thing. I can't live like this. I can't. Oh, honey, we gotta find out how to fix this. How? I, I don't know. Maybe maybe something in your head that gets all twisted. I'm not crazy. Oh, I know. I know you're not crazy. I'm not saying that. It's just that you gotta do something about it. I mean, if at least you could prove it. Have you been able to prove it before? I saw who murdered her. I saw his face. It was Doug Brister. Doug? Mm-hmm. Ah, come on, give me a break. This is just a guy that comes into the bar. Daniel, you can't say that. I mean, you know how dangerous it is, accusing people? That's what I saw. Well, maybe you have this weird thing with guys that you're attracted with. Who knows? I mean, we all got weird stuff going on, but you can't just choose a guy and accuse him of, of murder. Danielle is right. <gasps> oh, God, you scared the hell out of me. Oh, God. Oh, God. I killed her. You stay away from us. Everything you saw is true, Danielle. I'm a murderer. <laughs> I'm sorry. The look on your face is... <laughs> That was cruel. <laughs> oh, God. You're crazy, I know. man. I mean, I'm sorry. God. You're out there. You got me there for a second. You got me there. Yeah. He's I'm not sorry. joking. Yes. Of course I am. Of course he is. <laughs> Look at his face. He's oh. not serious. Gloria. <laughs> it's just a sick joke. I mean, Come on, I mean, Danielle. Yeah. Daniel, uh, someone can't just come up to you and say, yeah, keep people. <laughs> they you know don't do I mean? that. <laughs> Well, they don't. <laughs> you don't just walk up and say something like that, don't you? <laughs> Come on. <laughs>